What's happening, fam? LAR moving, still moving. Subscriber that trying. You see the thumbnail, like. Don't listen to him. You ain't gotta listen to him. He lying. Why are you always lying? This is a bad mother's favorite words. Um, in light of the thing that happened with Royce Reed, I just I, I was thinking. Cause I think sometimes. And I was like, you know, how many children Young adults and adults have grown up with their mother telling them that they don't have to listen to their father. And how has that affected people? I just saw something on Instagram where I'm guessing this is one or like one of Kanye West's daughter on TikTok singing she's in love with an emu girl. And I guess, you know, Kanye like, listen, man, I told y'all don't have to bring my daughter around these shenanigans. But you're doing it anyways. And in my opinion, if that's his daughter and that's Kim K, his his ex-wife, letting her do these things that she once said she wasn't going to do when they were together, then in my opinion, it's trolling. You, you know, she's using the daughter as a weapon to troll uh, his father, knowing that that'll set him off because for him, that's bad parenting. Because where is this going to lead? Down a bad road. And I thought about that. Same thing with the Dwight Howard situation. And I was like, see, a lot of y'all don't realize, even with this I've been abandoned talk, a lot of y'all don't want to take into consideration that you've, you know, as mothers, as bad mothers, you've told people, you've told your children not to listen to their father. Their father was giving them great advice, giving them discipline, giving them order, giving them structure. But you undermine that because of your inner pettiness. And now that kid grows up and gets older and then, I don't know why you act like that. You don't understand why they're rebellious? You taught them to be rebellious. You taught them that they could say or do anything to anybody. You taught them they didn't have to listen to anybody but you. And people wonder why there's a, um, who says that? I forget. Was it, was it, is it Dennis Sperling or Ron Williams? One of the brothers talk about, talk about a simp chip, you know. You wonder why these guys have a simp chip. And these girls have a simp chip, you know, for gr for girls and guys raised by girls that are bad mothers, you know, because that simp chip is, she wouldn't lie to me and do nothing wrong to me. I'm going to believe all women because my lying mother was believable. It's like, all right, all right, no problem. So, and it's hard to 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 come back from that when you realize you've been lied to. And you've been lying to yourself the whole time also to the point where nothing is believable. You know, yeah, I know I did something wrong, but this time it ain't going to be wrong. Yeah, I did something bad, but this time it ain't going to be bad. I'm going to do the exact same thing that was wrong and the exact same thing that was bad. But, you know, be, you know, I was told, you know, when God, when a man tells me, you know, my dad, if my daddy ain't going to tell me nothing because I ain't got to listen to him, why would I listen to you? Okay, why you get your why you get beat upside the head with a billy club? Because you didn't listen. You know, people don't have to put up with your rebelliousness because you were taught to be a rebel. And that's why you got grown men who can tower over women, but when a woman grab, come here, boy, you got to do this and anything. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I know, ma'am. I know. Oh, I should act better. My mama raised me better. No, she didn't. No, she didn't. She just raised you to <laughs> cowering by all the women. But when a guy said, hey, man, come here. What's wrong with you? Man, you ain't gonna talk to me like that. <sighs> I don't have a daddy. I had to disrespect my father all my life. And I ain't gonna never, I ain't gonna let him talk to me any kind of way. And I ain't gonna let you talk to me any kind of way. Good, huh? <laughs> and I... <laughs> Uh, miss my daddy. I don't know why you don't talk to me. Yeah, you know why. Because you, you you trifling. You was raised to be trifling. And you think you're going to disrespect the grown man. Because your mama said so. And it's going to be all good. You crazy. Um, Dolly Parton. Whitney Houston reference with the end I think. <laughs> you know. I'm going to disrespect you daily. But I still I'm gonna always love you. And I don't understand why you can't stick around for me talking crazy to you. Like, are you out your mind? You know, my mother raised me to be this way. That's why I don't nobody like you. 
You notice that, right? That's why you don't have no friends, and that's why the family you got on your mama's side of the family gets on your nerves because y'all all are stupid. And But bad mothers create this kind of dynamic all the time, all the time. And it's not a big deal for them because, hey, you know, as long as you follow her instructions, that's all you need to do. When she tell you to jump, you're supposed to say, ha ha, boys, ha ha. My mother's God in my mind. She told me she laid down me in green pastures. <laughs> you know, if God was a guy, I wouldn't listen to him. I'd rather go to hell. Because my mama said, don't listen to him. Don't listen to no man. He lying. <laughs> Jesus had a skirt on, so he really loved his mother. Like, it's, we, we, we're, we're really out of there. See how this don't listen to him goes bad. So when all these situations like with Royce Reed goes bad, I said they're going to blame the father, Dwight Howard. You know, same thing with these ladies. You know, when a man says something, ah, it's bashing. Because anything a man says is negative because men are negative and men are evil and men are bad. Where did you get that from? From Danny Glover and Larry Fishbone and the color purple and what's love got to do with it. Every time a man talks, all I hear is, if you die on me, I'm a key enemy. So, you know, so every time a brother talks, that's all they, these women hear. Everything you done to me, already done done to you, daddy. Okay, and then you did it to yourself, and now you don't know, and your mama can't fix it, because your mama don't know nothing but trifling. And now you, Dad, I just need you to forgive me for all the things I did, because I don't know what I'm doing no more, and I don't know why I'm suffering. I don't deserve to suffer for all the disrespectful stuff I did. Karma not supposed to happen to me. <laughs> My mama's suffering, too. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? She used to be cute, but now she ugly. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Your mama, yeah, that's good, that's good. I hope all y'all suffer. Uh, God bless y'all. Uh, I'm just saying, you know, I, now, you know, sorry, but if y'all keep raising these kids to not listen and then they go out into the world and create all this drama because they don't want to listen, that's your bad parenting. Anyway, I'm done. Like, share, subscribe, or die trying. I love you. I love you. But if you're doing that, I don't love you. We out, man. Peace.